y'all, it's Tammy with Card Valley Cooks. And this morning, we're coming at you live. I'm going to do some sausage muffins. Uh, Amy's got company, so I'm making some breakfast for them. Hope you enjoy this video. And we're going to brown a third pound of sausage. So the great part about this video is I've already got it. The first batch in the oven, so y'all are going to get to see the final product when I'm done. This is a ground beef separator. Um, it's a pampered chef tool. It is on my utensils on my website if you want to get you one. Um, it works really good to separate ground beef. Now, sausage is a little stickier, so it's a little more difficult. Now, if you want to use a little onion in these muffins, now's the time to throw it in. I'm not going to put an onion because I'm cooking for teenagers. But you can always chop up um, a little bit of onion and throw in here. Green onion would be really good too. So we're just going to brown this. And while this is getting browned, uh, I'm going to put just a little bit of oil in it because sausage don't, you think it's full of fat, but then when you try to fry it, it's not the easiest thing to do. So we're going to get over here to the table. And we're going to start cutting in our butter into our flour while it's brown. I'm actually going to use my blending fork to cut my butter into my flour. So we're going to hop over here to the other side. So we're going to put a cup of self-rising flour in our bowl. Let me turn down this sausage. I'll put it on low. So you can just put your sausage on low while you're preparing your uh, muffin mix if you want to. I'm going to use about a quarter cup of butter. And I'm going to use my blending fork and blend that into the flour. Blending fork is amazing for a lot of things. So if you don't have one, I suggest you get you one. You'll thoroughly enjoy it. You can get those on my website too. www.carvalleycooks.com all right, we got two thirds cup of milk in this. In this, I'm going to take two eggs and crack them in the milk. All right, I'm going to beat these up a little bit with my blending fork. move this butter out of the way. We don't need it anymore. So now we need uh, about a half cup of sliced cheddar cheese. I mean grated. So I'm going to put in about a quarter cup of mild and about a quarter cup of sharp. And then we're going to add our liquid ingredients. And we're going to mix it up. Now, I'm going to go get my sausage and put down in there, y'all. And remember what I said. If you've got, uh, if you want onion, you know, make sure you brown your onion when you're doing your sausage. I'm going to get this in the bowl. Yummy. OK, 
Okay? These are like, kind of like sausage balls in a way, except they're better. They're a breakfast muffin, okay? So we put our sausage in there, we got our cheese in there, our flowers in there, our eggs, butter, uh, and now I'm gonna put just a little bit of cream cheese in it. And when you do your cream cheese, you're actually going to, um, just one second, let me fix this. Okay, and when you do your cream cheese, you're actually going to um, cut it in like little cubes, okay? So that hopefully each little muffin will get a little bit of cream cheese, okay? So you're just going to cut like little cubes into the batter. And you could always leave this step out. You don't have to have the cream cheese. Of course, there's plenty of cheese in it already. But if you've got it, go ahead and do this step two. This is gonna make 24 mini muffins or 12 larger muffins. Um, the ones that I have in the oven right now cooking so that y'all can see what they look like when they're done are mini muffins. But we're gonna make a pan of regular muffins. I'm going to do about, you can do about three ounces. I'm just cutting off two strips and cubing it. And then that's all I'm going to put in there. I think that's plenty. So you can use your judgment on how much cream cheese you want to put in yours. Let's go ahead and stir that up before I put any more in. Okay. So if you're just tuning in, y'all make sure to share my videos and hit the like button. Uh, this is Colored Valley Cooks. I cook Southern food. I live in Georgia. And uh, this morning we are making a breakfast muffin. It has a third pound of sausage browned. Um, half cup of cheddar cheese shredded. Two-thirds cup of buttermilk, a cup of flour, and a quarter cup of butter. And now they're ready. That's all there is to it, y'all. This would be a really good breakfast if you've got a lot of people over during the holidays. Uh, Christmas breakfast. You could actually... Uh, feed everybody and it'd be easy to clean up you know it's got the, it's got everything in there and then um, you wouldn't have a whole lot to clean up later trying to find my all right we're going to use my little eighth cup scoop and we're going to fill the, these muffin tins up with an eighth cup I mean, they're definitely done. So let's throw these other ones in there. And you want to make sure and make them um, on 350 now, okay? Because if you make them on 350, they got a lot of stuff in them. You want to make sure that they get good and done. All right, you can see the cheese on there. Little muffin. Let's open it up and see how it looks on the inside. Woo, that's hot. Woo. You can see the piece of cream cheese inside. See it? Wow. They're like sausage balls. <clears throat> Excuse me. They're like sausage balls a lot. Like sausage balls, except they got more stuff in them. They're really good. I put onions in this batch. So remember, when you're browning your sausage, <clears throat> excuse me, 
when you're browning your sausage, cut you up some diced onion in there or a green onion in there, and it'll even add more flavor to your breakfast muffin. Mmm, they're so good. My kids are going to love these. Hope y'all have a great Saturday. Thanks for watching Color Valley Cooks, where we cook like Mama did. This is a good holiday recipe, for real. Bye.